Where are you burying that milk bone? Well, good morning, Miss Tilly. I heard her come home last night. There's you a big old pepperoni that a subscriber sent. Look at this lazy Lou in here and all the warm cheater chips. Guess what, Melly? I discovered something about you. I never knew. Now I feel bad. But I'm really glad that you're here because of it. Good morning. I rarely watch my own videos. But this morning I happened to click on one of them that came up. And what I saw shocked me. I'm going to show that to you here in a minute. But right now I'm getting inside because it's 30 degrees. Them girls, I put my hand in that doghouse. Oh man, those things are warm. Look at this one. Burying the treat I gave her. Ah, cool crisp morning. I'll take this over heat any day, guys. Sun's about to pop. It's going to come up right here. Rooster, you go get back in there. Once you get in there with sister, you'll be even warmer. Yeah, I filled them up with uh, pine chips the other day. So they're warm. And they got a heated water bowl. You ready to come in? You're in here, out here goofing around. Out here goofing around, come on. All right. She won't, she won't be out there long. Oh, man. I couldn't believe what I saw this morning. I'm getting ready to show it. I'm going to get in there and for a minute and talk to you. Woo, it's nice and warm in here. Let's check on you guys. Got plenty of water. Peter's a blowing. Why don't we put your TV on? Cause you know brother likes to watch his TV in the morning. Oh, I don't like this. Uh, I like this stuff, but not in here. Waldo lays by the walls, pushes it in. I think I'm gonna do the foam board in here. All right, boy, I'm putting your shows on. Did you go out? I gave him a milk bone. He has to run outside like Lily's gonna take it from him. I don't think she's gonna take it. All right, why does this thing take so long? We all wanna, we're all waiting to see what's on, I know. Okay. Well, hold on, boy. Well, I swear when it gets cool. Oh, oh, Thanksgiving week or Petsgiving. Petsgiving weekend. I bet you did forgot all about that. I know. Well, that's not a pet. That's a naked girl. Oh, well, there's a bear. I tell you, they'll put anything on here. Oh. There's a puppy dog. He's in the water on a leash. I don't know about that. All right. I'm going to go in and put this movie up, okay? Well, I've never seen you do that before. You want this remote? That ain't happening, sir. Because I know what it would happen with that remote. He's my boy. What you doing, Lily? How come you guys are... Did you guys switch beds? Yeah. You wouldn't believe what I discovered this morning. Well, I'll have the movie out soon and I'll put it up here on the TV for you to see because I couldn't believe it. But I'm fixing to show people. Okay? Alright, you go and lay down and stay warm. I turned the heater up a little bit too. Because, you know, it's only, it's only like 60. That's not warm enough. Spoiled body. Alright. I discovered something this morning that I couldn't believe. I didn't remember. I don't think anybody did. I don't think Jeff remembered. I don't I didn't. I remembered the situation. But I didn't think it was the same dog. So like I said before, I was watching a video. I never watch my own videos. I never go back and watch them unless I'm looking for something in particular uh but this morning i just happened to click on one where me and greg were putting uh metal on jeff's well house when he first moved there he went he hadn't even moved in there yet and this dog showed up and it was starving had a collar on 
it was a hunter's dog. I know it was a hunter's dog because they leave that extra collar that looks absolutely ridiculous on the dog and it had a nameplate. And I'm sure I looked at it. Uh, I don't think I recognized the name of the person. So I assumed it was a hunter that lost its dog or the dog was out running. I don't know. But now I know the whole story. Okay. Because this dog was Millie two years ago. Millie came here about the same time last year. Almost an entire year later. Now when this dog showed up at Jeff's, I gave it some eggs. It was very hungry. It was She was not skittish of people. Not at all. Uh, I, I could walk right up to her and feed her. And I think she was just so... You'll see in the video how bad she looked. And then when she showed up here a year later, she didn't have a collar. And she looked just as bad. So if you want to know survival skills of a dog, that Millie has some. And she's out there now. She's not skittish of me anymore. But something happened in that year. I think she just... She was out on her own for an entire year. I don't know. Maybe we'll never know. But I think it's that's why I'm making this video because I was so amazed that a year later, and I did go back two years ago. We were at Jeff's uh, having another work. That was before he moved in, right after I met Jeff. And we were doing another work party thing, and she just she she had been there, I guess, when Jeff had first got there. And so I gave her some eggs, and you could walk right up to her. I think I patted her on the head. Uh, she laid there. Everybody's running around. She wasn't scared. And something happened in, you know, that time period where she did not trust people anymore. And I did go back to try to get her, and she was gone. And I could not find her. I brought food. I was going to try to get her. I didn't know how that would go. But she showed up here one year later in the same month october of 22 she showed up here but the, the first video you're going to see is october of 21 october 21st uh, 2021 and she was in terrible shape i figured you know when i went back couldn't find her i didn't figure she'd make it so Somehow she had a connection to Jeff's place. I don't know. She was one of the hunter's dogs around there. She was definitely a hunter's dog. Uh, maybe she was mistreated. I don't know the story. But all I know is over the course of the last year, you know, she's come to get out of the skittishness that she's been in. You know, it, it's never too late with a dog. You just got to get them to trust you again. But I thought that was pretty amazing. And I remember seeing the dog, but I did, when I looked at it this morning, I'm like, my God, that was Millie. So she went another whole year without proper care. And how she made it, I don't know. That's probably behind part of the story while she'll take off for a day or two. And then she, she, she goes straight to the forest. She don't go anywhere near the road. She goes right behind me. There's 20 miles of forest. And she's back in there this morning. She, she wasn't here last night, but she's here tonight. You can't put a dog like that in a yard. You just can't. And I won't. And she seems to, she knows how to take care of herself. So when it, so she's actually a little older than I thought. Because in that video, the first one you'll see, she was probably at least two years old. If not three. So she may be a little older than I first thought. I, I was putting her at about three, maybe four, but she may be closer to six. And so that's, that shocked me. So, and, and I don't think nobody ever caught it. I didn't, but that was Millie. You'll see in the first video, I'm putting that up next. It's, it's Millie for sure. All right, guys, just a silly video this morning, but I thought it was pretty amazing how that dog survived another whole year. You'll see her in this, how she looks, how she survived another year. Maybe the hunter found her, uh, took her back to wherever they were. I don't know, but I, I doubt that. There's no, no way to get into her mind to find out. But she's safe now, and as long as she stays here, she's got a home. I bet I got rooster furs all over this black sweatshirt. So if you see that, Man, it's you, you can't stop the rooster furs. The rooster hairs, you can't. 
All right, guys, I got to get out there in a little bit and do a review on the laser machine. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that in one day, but you'll see it later. Happy trails. Thanks for watching. Here's the videos. Let's go show you Jeff's new dog, Bobble Lou. Where you at, Bobble Lou? Burning going on. There's Bobble Lou. Yeah. You need a good meal. My God, you're skinny. What you doing, baby girl? Pretty close. Well, they make two different ones. Well, this one will definitely work. I can show you how it works. Okay. Um. Alright, just a little girl that showed up here at Jeff's. He doesn't have any dog food. She's pretty hungry. So he does have eggs, and dogs love eggs. Isn't that good, girl? Oh, yeah. Eat your shells. That'll give her some protein and energy. That's Baba Lou. Well, Miss Millie and Libby been become pretty good friends. They're usually laying together. Yeah, getting some sun, but I just walked towards Millie a little bit. She took off, but she's coming closer to me. Yeah, she slept right by the house last night, and a coyote or something came in. She went chasing after it, barking. That's the first time I've heard her bark, so she's getting better. Olivia, you didn't even come out of your doghouse. Right now, I'm going to make a makeshift doghouse for Millie. Uh, she slept right by the cabin last night and something came through sometime last night she started after it and barking so she likes to be close uh, wherever I'm at she ain't far behind but she just she won't come up to me yet she will and uh, not much I can do with her until then you know I can't put a collar on her I seen she had a tick on her uh, I'm gonna get her a next guard give her that she'll eat anything at this point so she'll have no problem eating that and uh i guess she's here to stay she's not like doing like when tilly came she tilly would eat hang out a little bit and take off and millie's just staying around she's gonna be a good dog so we'll let her stay uh i don't have any plans to put her in a yard i gotta watch her if she doesn't leave the property she ain't gonna get a yard uh she can just be the perimeter dog we'll see how she does all right let's let's go see what we can find make her a little bit better uh, shelter to sleep in at night and i'm going to stop tomorrow and get her a barrel those are great they're warm they're dry they're durable and you stuff them with hay and they love them they're comfortable for the dogs all right what you millie doing you telling millie stories or is she telling you stories how come your ears inside out millie how come I'm gonna come sit. I'm gonna pet on Libby. 
You want to come and get some petting? Yeah. Well, come here. Here it's almost. <laughs> She's getting comfortable. Well, you're coming closer. See, I'm not hurting Libby. Come here, sweet girl. Well, what you doing? You're gonna come for head pettings eventually. You know you are. I think you're putting on a little weight. You know, I still see your backbone, but I see that on Libby. She ain't thin, skinny. But you do need work. So it's almost time for your dry or your wet food with the wormer. Your last day of worming. Yeah. Well, come here. Can you come here? Come on. You know she wants to. Very skittish, man. Whoever had her must have beat the hell out of her. I wish I could get about five minutes with them. Most dogs, for the most part, are not skittish unless something bad happened to them. But the good thing about dogs is they can change. Yeah, what's the moaning about? Millie. Millie Milligan. That's your name. I call you Milligan more than Millie. What kind of life have you had? I say you're about a year and a half, two years old. And I'm pretty good at bump guessing puppy dog ages. Yeah, what do you think? You're eight years old. And she's grumble grump, grumble grumping. <laughs> What's wrong, girl? Go see Melly. Well, she's about four feet away from me now. I've been inching my chair closer. She hasn't gotten up and gotten scared. I'm Ellie. Yeah. Give me a week. We'll be petting that head. I'll live. What you doing, girl? Ellie Milligan. Still got this one. Alright, I'm giving her this high protein stuff and I've got the wormer right there and I'm gonna mix it in. Alright, let's go into my messy screen patio. Where you at, Melly? <laughs> Look at her. She knows what this bowl means. Here you go, baby. Here's your warmer. I wouldn't tell a normal dog it's warmer. Here. Well, you don't have to back up so far. You're getting better. Can you come right up to me and get it? Come on. Come on. Can I be back off one? See, now I have to back off 10 feet now. Look at this, guys. That's what dog man does. No, no. Come on. I'm going to take a knee right here. You come up and get it. Good girl. See? I'm going to hurt you. See, she's got... It looks to me like she had a Somebody shot her with a BB gun on her hip. I'm not sure. She's fine. Looks like I see a fly on her ear. It's okay. Yeah. Come on back. Come on. I'll back up a bit. Come on. Don't finish it. You gotta get over this. Okay. Come on. It's okay. Come on. I'm not gonna hurt you. skinny she is. We'll get her over that. Come on. Come on. Milly Milligan. Yeah, you gonna come like that ball one more time? Come on. Here, let's put this down. Put this down. 
What are you gonna do with that? What is that? Is it? I'm gonna be petting you in three days. Three days? Yeah, I will. Come here. Come here. I can't have a treat every time. She's watching every move I make. Come here. Come on, it's okay. You don't have to be so scared. I want that tail wagon soon. Come on. Come see me. Come see me. Come here. Well, I've tamed worse dogs than you. Grumpy. Yeah, Grumpy, he, he was mean. You're not mean. You're just chicken. You scared of that camera. Well, I bet if I back off, you'll come sniff on it. What is that? What is that camera? You gonna come see it? Yeah? What are you gonna do? Good girl. Don't take my camera. You are a good girl. And this is where she slept last night. And I just took this board because I'm going to get her a barrel tomorrow. And that way it keeps keeps the wind off of her. It's only going to be for one more night. She'll be fine. But uh, she sure looks out for us. She barks. <laughs> All right. Guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe. Give me a like, give me an unlike. I don't care. Happy trails. What are you jumping?